come back. The leader of the Freedom Front Plus annoyed members of the ruling party as well as opposition parties when he argued in parliament that black people had no right to claim 40% of land in South Africa. Mr. Motswane Malale of the ANC accused Dr. Mulder of distorting history. The Freedom Front uh, Plus leader, Dr. Mulder, in his response uh, to the State of the Nation debate, had the temerity to suggest that Africans cannot lay claim to 40% of South Africa's land because they migrated from Northern Africa. He contends that Africans cannot lay claim to the land in the Western Cape and the Northern Cape because they are not the original inhabitants of this land. His sweeping generalizations applied to his land maps of the 19th century ignore the persistent legacy of colonial dispossession, history of conquest and collusion to suggest that when white colonialists arrived here, the land was empty is a distortion of our painful history and heaps scorn on the current inequalities we experience as a result of colonial invasion. But even if we were to ignore his false and misleading statements, is he suggesting that the majority people of people who suffered at the hands of the four trackers, the imperialist colonialists, and the racist white apartheid regime be relegated to the end of the line and the maximum white ownership and privilege continue unabated. He bases his venomous views on, on, on what can only be termed as his myopic understanding of our history, tainted by selfishness and shaded by racism. The ANC believes that Dr. Mulder will do well Thank to you, make an effort remember. to learn the truth and assist from history. Thank you. Yep. I'd like to agree with Honorable Malale that uh, the 40% story by the Deputy Minister of Agriculture is a dangerous one, and the President said so. It That's is. all we have time for. Join us again tomorrow for another edition of A View from the House. Until then, goodbye.